So how does it work? What is the mechanism of action of active specific immunotherapy in autoimmune diseases? ASI for autoimmune diseases. It is well known that abnormalities in the idiotypic network can result in the expression and expansion of autoantibodies. Healthy adults usually have a low concentration of autoantibodies. However, disruption in the idiotypic network uh, leads to the expression and elevation of circulating autoantibody levels, which can result in the development of the autoimmune disease. And in this case, the role of the active specific immunotherapy is to reduce the production of anti-idiotypic antibodies by adding immune activating substances to the autologous blood collected to convert the autoantibodies to specific harmless immunogens, which are molecules capable of eliciting an immune response. Anti-idiotypic antibodies specific to autoantibodies are present in patients during remission and or are present in healthy individuals. And anti-idiotypic antibodies are absent during the periods of the active disease or the flare-up of the autoimmune disease. So how does it work? What is the mechanism of action of active specific immunotherapy in autoimmune diseases? Once administered, the patient's own immune system will recognize the immunogens and produce anti-idiotypic antibodies which bear the internal image of the host cells. The anti-idiotypic antibodies produced will competitively bind to the autoantibodies instead of attacking the patient's own cells. This neutralizes and inhibits the further production of autoantibodies, thereby helping to restore a balanced ileotypic network in the patient's body. Maintenance of this equilibrium is essential to ensure that the immune system can effectively fight against exogenous antigens without attacking self-antigens that could potentially lead to the development of autoimmune diseases. In summary, SI is a promising treatment for autoimmune diseases due to the immunomodulatory potential of anti-idiotypic antibodies.